Just look at that. You know what that is? That is a beautiful sunrise. Hello everyone, and it is time to get stupid, by which I mean let's play Roguecraft. No, 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 not yet. We're not going to play Roguecraft yet. It, it seems wrong. To just jump into things. So we're gonna sit here and we're gonna watch the sunrise for a little bit. Because holy shit, I deserve it after what happened. But no! No, 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 no! You go away! Who likes you? Fucking ender jerks. I don't have anything to do with him right now. Any seed? Yes. Can I feed? Um, excuse me, can I? I cannot. Well, that's fine. We're gonna just not. So. The goal for today was gonna be iron. So that's what we're gonna do. I saw the sapling right here out of the corner of my eye. Thought it was a fucking, tree, a fucking creeper. You must die. You did. God, I'm bad at blocking. No, we can't do this. This cannot be. No. Die at my hands! But not today. I don't see any creepers around though, so that's good. Let's take this opportunity to go do the thing. I want you. And soon I will have you. How much wood do I have? The one block. So we were gonna save that because charcoal? And, oh! That's no longer a sapling. That's a tree. I will advantage of that. But first, this shit down here. This shit? You see this shit? I don't like it. Oh, there's coal over there. I'm gonna just go grab it while we're out. God damn it, I got my face punched in. Oh, leave me some zombie flesh. Grass, zombie flesh. Where am I? Oh, that's right. I ate all the chicken because <laughs> last time. Oh boy, that was the roughest start I've had. And remember, I've done this. This is the nineteenth attempt. Placed coal. I will take some of that. That'll actually allow me to put my wood to use for things other than coal, which would be nice. Let's have a proper uh, tree farm set up. I won't need to be so concerned, so stingy with my wood, but I will for now. <clears throat> I'm gonna just dump a bunch of this. Miscellaneous garbage. Oh, that's right. I, I, I sat down to record. I thought to myself, I need to go look something up. I couldn't remember what it was that I needed to look up. Horses, do they drop leather? Now, I'm not just going to go randomly killing them for their... Oh, this is a creeper. Wait, what happened here? Creeper. That's what happened. At least I think that's what Pretty sure that's what happened, yeah. Because say this could be naturally generated terrain. But it doesn't look like it. Oh hey chicken. Um I will probably need to uh, relocate you. Also, I need to eat the rest of the zombie flesh. 
that's not going to do me enough good because the whole point of eating the Zambi flesh was to put me at full hunger just long enough to start recovering. I'm making a decision regarding this, this mountain area. Part of it gets uh, raised. And the rest of it... Ooh, that was dangerous. Let's make a rip apart. So that I know where is safe and where is... Oh god, I'm burning alive. Shouldn't be faffing around up here, though, because I've got things I gotta get doing, but I can do those things later. I guess the other thing is it'll let me let that it'll let that tree over there grow bigger so I'll get more wood out of the harvest. Really not super keen on happening is if it gets to be a supersized tree. That could be problematic. Yeah, as you can tell this is not super safe. This is not safe either. Oh no, that's safe. Never mind. Anything down here looks up to code. Alright. Yeah, some of that needs to go, but that's a project for another day. And yeah, I'm making the decision. I'm gonna. Because the other problem with it is if the tree gets too big, it grows branches, and those are a pain to cut down. out later. Also, reminder to suture me, remember to cut um, boring shit like this out in the future. Or at least super speed it. Yes! Apple. These are, serve two very important features. You can eat them. You can turn also turn them into golden apples. Golden apples can be eaten, and they will also heal you a little bit. But the big important deal about them is that you can feed them to zombie villagers and turn them into not zombies. And that's something I plan on doing later. Um... Let me just plant that. A bit of collection here. I've got a bunch, but you know, shit, sun's getting down real fast. Gotta find me some sheep. Oh, that's the other thing I gotta be careful about. Yeah. Dudes don't spawn down here when I'm not down here, but... Well, no, dudes spa don't spawn down here if I am. Because mobs will never spawn naturally within a certain radius of your face. That being said... I walk away and I haven't lit this place up. There could be a creeper down here when I come back, and I don't want that. So, we light this shit up, and this is a lot more iron than I was expecting. Did I hear a thing? I don't think I heard a thing. Yeah, how much iron I got? 15. Nice. Um, I will put that to work. Shortly here. Um, oh yeah, the whole thing is I wasn't, I didn't want to dig that out, but what the fuck ever. Anyway, other thing I'm 
going to do is mine out some gravel. Here's the fun thing about gravel. The torch down underneath it when they're falling. They'll fall on the torch and break. This is not worth it because it will always drop gravel 100% of the time instead of the percentage chance to drop flint, which is useful, unlike gravel. Well, gravel has its niche uses, but I don't intend on availing myself of those in any near point in time. Whatever. I don't care. I'm going to chop this down to get the light to spread in a little bit more. I'm going to park a torch here. Because right now I don't have a butt ton of torches. I'm going to take this down because it offends me. And it's sunset. So, time to not be here. So, the following is about to happen. I'm an idiot. It's fine, guys. Everything's fine and nothing is ruined. Okay, now I think I hear creatures, but it doesn't, it's a faint noise and it doesn't sound like any creature I recognize. Also, normally, hey Chivo, normally chickens and similar creatures make noise. I have that disabled for obvious reasons. and be a not be a not baby anymore no okay that's fine whatever don't care I don't have any pumpkins yet so I'm gonna throw eggs at the wall and get chickens so I got me some iron this unlocked achievement and let's make several things the first thing I'm making is a bucket it's a bucket Take water. I can put water somewhere else. This is incredibly useful. Now I'm gonna just gonna block off this little part of the world. Oh no! I'm removing water from the world. There. Water's gone. For now, at least. Uh, how much dirt do I have? Enough. I just really want the gravel out of here. Because it will come in handy later. And holy shit, that is lag. But more importantly, I really want to just have this place be dirt and stay that way. Gravel's a security hazard, and beyond that, it annoys me. And that's the important thing here. Let's let's be honest. Let's not lie to ourselves. So here is the mechanic of water. Water comes in two flavors, source and flow. Source blocks don't have flow, as you can see. They're just kind of still. You can pick up a source block with a bucket. You cannot pick up a flow with a bucket. Flow decreases in intensity until, well not necessarily in velocity, but the flow gets weaker until you get a certain number of blocks away from the source, and then it won't flow anymore. However, it will continue to flow if it changes height. If, it fall, if the flow falls, it resets the counter. 
similar furthermore you can create source blocks if a source block is say here there's, let's pretend this is a source block and there's this water let's pretend this isn't water source block here if I put a source block here then the flow will be converted into a source block. This happens if there are two source blocks with diagonally adjacent to one another. You can take advantage of this to create infinite water sources anywhere you care to go if you have access to two source blocks. At that point you can make an arbitrarily large number of source blocks with a bucket. Lava works the same way with the exception that you cannot create source blocks in the way I just described, but it follows the same mechanics of flow. And of course you can't swim in lava, at least not for very long. We will be able to swim in lava later. I will probably not show it off just because it wastes resources to do and also is pointless and dangerous, but you know, whatever. So, now we wait. chicken when I get a chance. Oh, I'm gonna do a thing with the rest of the iron I picked up. Um, iron pickaxe. This allows you to pick up the rest of the resources. With an iron pickaxe, you can mine out any block except for two. And by any block, I mean any block that's made out of stone or similar materials. You don't use a pickaxe on trees. That's not a thing you do. reason why gravel is not entirely 100% useless. If you have gravel, you can turn it into flint, which you can then combine with chickens. Damn. And then, voila, arrows. It's pretty great. Um, I don't need an iron sword yet. The other main reason you want iron is for armor. I can technically make armor out of leather. I don't have leather. It's also weaker. And... No, don't do that. Um, you can also make armor out of gold, but again, don't do that. Ah, sunrise. 